Hello everyone, I'm Engineer Darren Tacobanza, a licensed electronics engineer. And in this video, we will talk about how can you use your Casio FX570 ES Plus in solving engineering problems. So in this topic, we will talk about differential equations. Let's read the sample problem. The direction of a particle is described by an ordinary differential equation y prime is equal to y squared x cubed. What is the solution of this problem? We can use a calculator technique by assigning values of c and x. c will be equal to 1 and x will be 0.1. Let's, let's choose option b as our example. In your calculator, let's type the following equation. Negative 4 over x to the fourth x to the fourth plus c then press calc and you will be asked what will be the value of x and c in this case 0.1 and 1 let's take note of this answer by storing it on a memory variable we store this on variable e the next step will be computing for the derivative of option b Let's type again the equation. 84 x cubed or x squared x x to the fourth rather x to the fourth plus c with the limit of point one. And this is the answer. Let's store this on another memory variable. In this case, we will compare this to the given differential equation. Let's solve for the value of y squared x cubed. By typing this, this equation, y squared x to the fourth, x to the three, x cubed, you will be asked what will be the value of y. This is for y, x is 0.1. The answer is this figure. You will notice that it is equal to the derivative of the option b, which is stored on variable f. Let's check if it's correct. So since this is the same, the solution for this differential equation will be this function. So that's it. Thank you for watching and listening in this video tutorial. I hope that you learn a calculator technique in solving some engineering problems. Thank you and see you on the next video.